A fun little thing that I like to do with my 3D models, because you're like, how do you pose the 3D models? There are a couple different ways you can pose it. Again, I'm a very basic girl. I'll just click on the 3D model. Click on the 3D model, okay. And you see these dots. Let me zoom in so you guys can really see. So you guys can really see these dots. I wanna show you these dots. Cause there's like a different editor when it comes to the 3D models. And it took me a while to learn this. But any hoodles, let's click this character. Look at these dots. I love these dots because these make it so easy. Look, I can just move her head super easy. Look, look. She's looking over here, looking over there. She's looking that way, looking this way. I use the purple dots. Now, some of you might have accidentally double clicked and gotten the precision editor, and you're like, why is this not working? This is too hard. That's the precision editor. That's more of an advanced step. If you're a beginner, or even if you're not a beginner and you're just like, that's just too much, just double click, double click one more time and get back to the dots. And the dots, they're your friends. They move it for you. They're like, hey, we'll go ahead and just match it up to where it, it looks like it, it looks normal. So use the dots to pose. I use the dots to pose. I can turn stuff with the green. I can use the green arrow to lift it up and then pull it back. Just use the purple dots. They're your best friends. That's what I use.